everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a review on something that was actually requested a lot for me to do, and it is on Sigma Makeup Brushes. So lately I have been getting a ton of messages of people asking me to do a review on Sigma Makeup Brushes and asking me for my thoughts. Um, just people saying they're kind of hesitant, they're not sure if they should buy them or not, and I was just like, why would you want my thoughts and why would you want me to do a review on these products if there's already like 10 million reviews of this product on YouTube already. But a lot of people just want to know my thoughts on these products. So I'm going to be doing a review on the Sigma Makeup Brushes today. And I think that it's really good. I know that there's a lot of reviews of Sigma Makeup Brushes already on YouTube. But but when I'm thinking about buying a new product, I don't just watch one review on it and then decide if I'm going to get it or not. I watch like... 10 reviews on it and then that helps me decide if I want to get it or not so I think it's good to have a lot of different reviews of the same product a lot of different opinions and stuff like that and I also want to say that these products were sent to me um, but you guys know that doesn't affect the way I review them in any way um, I've had a chance to try every single one of these brushes and I'm reviewing them with my personal experience and um, I'm trying to help you guys to help you decide if you want to buy these brushes or not I'm not trying to get on here and be like a commercial and anything like that I'm just reviewing these products and letting you guys know what I think about them and also stay tuned for the end to figure out how you can win your own Sigma brush set so um, let's get started with the reviews so this is their full complete brush set this is $89.99 on the website with the brush roll or you can get the brushes without the brush roll for $69.99 but um, this is what the one with the brush roll looks like so it comes in a brush roll like this and it just says Sigma on the front and then on the back it just has this little magnet thing and you just open it up and this is a really good um, high quality brush roll and it's really good for taking your brushes on the go so they won't get messed up or damaged so this is what it looks like when you open it up and it has 12 makeup brushes so yeah just looks like this and also I want to say if you were to get every single one of these brushes from MAC Cosmetics it would be $310 that's um that's pretty bad um I mean I really like these brushes and honestly these are pretty much the same quality as MAC and I actually like these better than MAC so why would I spend $310 when you can just get this for $89.99? Um, so that's really, really good. But anyways, I'm just going to go through all of the brushes. And also to let you guys know, I have washed every single one of these brushes. I washed them before I used them, and none of them shed one hair, which I was really surprised with. I thought that they would like shed a lot, but um, they actually haven't shed at all pretty much. I think... A few brushes might have shed one hair when I was using them, but you're going to get that with makeup brushes. So the first one is the Sigma SS150 brush, and this is just a really big powder brush. I use this for bronzer, and I really, really like it. It's really big and soft. Um, I love this brush. Honestly, this is softer than my MAC brushes. It's so soft. Um, you can use this for powder, but I really like it for bronzer. And then we have the Sigma SS187 which this is the duo fiber brush it has like the black bristles right here and then the synthetic white bristles on top this is so soft honestly it is so extremely soft and this is really good for applying liquid foundation if you want an airbrushed finish and it's also good for cream blush it really works and it's super soft and I also like to use this for bronzer sometimes it's really nice the next one is the SS190 brush and here is the MAC 190, so this is the Sigma 190, and this is the MAC 190. Um, I'll just let you see them. So, I really like the Sigma one a little bit better, and also one thing about the um, Sigma brushes that I wanted to point out. Well, if you look at a MAC brush, you can see it says MAC, and then it says the number of the brush right here. And then if you look at the Sigma one, it says Sigma and the number of the brush right there. Um, so the MAC name and the number is right here, so when you're using the brush, the number is going to wear off so fast because, you know, you're using it and your hand can get sweaty. And um, actually a lot, this one's pretty good, but pretty much all my MAC brushes, the lettering is completely off. But the Sigma one, the letters are down more so that when you use the brush, you don't have to worry about, you know, this coming off. So that's a really, really big plus. And I really like this foundation brush. It gives you really nice full coverage and it's super soft. 
The next one is the SS168, and this is just an angled um, face brush. This is really good for contouring. It is so soft. Oh my gosh, this is so soft, and I love it. And you can also use it for blush. Um, it's a really nice brush. The next one is the SS194 brush. And this is just basically a really, really small concealer brush, and I love it for my blemishes. It just gets the concealer right on the blemish and completely covers it up, and it's so soft, and um, I really, really like it. The next one is the SS275, and this is just an angled eyeshadow brush. It's really soft and really fluffy. It's great for getting a defined crease, and um, I heard this was better than the MAC 275, and it's just so soft. The next one is the SS252 and this is just a big shader brush. It's really good for applying cream eyeshadow, cream bases, like paint pots and things like that. It's so soft and it's pretty dense so it really packs the color on nicely. The next one is the SS239 which this is the only brush out of the set that doesn't look like a MAC one. Um, here's the MAC 239 and here's the SS 239. So you can see the MAC one has white bristles and the Sigma one has brown bristles. Um, this one is a lot denser than the MAC 239 so it packs the color on a lot better. Um, so I really like this one. The next brush is the SS 224 and this is great for blending out your eyeshadow. It's good for the crease outer corner. Oh my gosh, I love this brush. It is so, so soft. The next one is... Wait, if I could put this brush back in. The next one is the SS219, and this is just like this small pencil smudger brush. It's really good for the outer corner and also for getting shadow on your lower lash line. This is probably one of my favorite brushes because, I don't know, it's just really nice. The next one is the 266, and this is just an angled eyeliner brush, and I don't use angled eyeliner brushes for eyeliner, I use them for my eyebrows, so I've been using this with my brow powder, and it works so good. It's really soft, it's a really nice eyeliner brush. And the last brush that comes in the set is the SS209, and this is just a really, really small eyeliner brush. It's really good for applying cream and gel eyeliners. It's like really stiff, but it's extremely soft at the same time, so I love that. And the last brush, this is like a little free gift. This is the SS217, and you get this as a little free gift with the brush set. It is so fluffy and so nice. It's so white, and I love the white bristles when they're new. It's really good for getting into the crease. I actually used this and it's amazing. So I really like these brushes. They have been working so well for me and it just shows girls that they don't need to spend a fortune to get high quality makeup brushes because Sigma brushes um, are the same quality as MAC if not better than MAC. I actually like these a lot better than MAC and I'm saying that honestly. Sigma really thinks about the customers when they're pricing these products and I think Sigma is just amazing because they're giving girls a chance to get high quality makeup brushes for an amazing price and um, the customer service is amazing. The people at Sigma are the sweetest. So, um, yeah, I really like that. Okay, and they also sent me a few of their other brushes that you can buy individually. They sent me their SS197, and this is $16 on the website. It's so soft, and I use this for my mineral foundation. Honestly, if you use mineral foundation, I recommend getting this brush. It is it is only $16 and it just buffs in the mineral foundation and gives you an amazing coverage. The next brush they sent me is the SS188, which this is like the 187, but it's smaller. If you can see, it's like teeny tiny and I love it. It's great for contouring if you really want to get a deep contour. It's also good for highlighting. If you were to buy this brush for MAC, it would be $34, but you can get it at Sigma for $14. That's like $20 off. That is amazing. This is so soft and it does not shed at all. The next brush they sent me was the SS109. And, and a lot of people have had problems with the MAC 109 saying that it shed like crazy. This one does not shed at all. At all. I'm not even kidding you. If you were going to get the MAC 109, do not get it. Get the Sigma. It is amazing. If you were to get the MAC 109, it would be $32, and if you get this one, it's only $14, so that is great. It's the softest brush. It's really dense, and I love it. 
And the last brush they sent me is the SS182 Kabuki brush. So here's the MAC 182 and here's the Sigma. The MAC one is definitely denser, but I actually like the feel of the Sigma 182. I think it's just a lot softer and smoother. And um, it really does buff your powder in a lot better. Um, I don't know, it's kind of a personal preference, whichever one you kind of want to get. If you're looking for a more dense kabuki brush, then the MAC one might be the one for you. But I really like the Sigma one just because it's so soft. It is dense. It's just not as dense as the MAC one. The if you want the MAC 182 Kabuki, you will have to pay $45. And for the Sigma one, you only have to pay $19. That is amazing. And honestly, this brush is softer than the MAC 182, and it buffs in powder perfectly. Okay, and there's also two other products that they sent me that I want to show you guys because I think they would be the cutest Valentine's Day gifts. I just want to show you guys really fast. Um, they have a Hollywood Glamour collection, and they sent me two products from there. They sent me their Princess Grace Retractable Kabuki Brush, and it is so cute. It says, get some Hollywood Glamour. The Sigma Makeup Retractable Kabuki is the easiest way to apply powder products such as blush, bronzer, foundation, and highlighter on the go. Practical and classy, the Hollywood Glamour collection is a must. So it looks like this, and it comes in different colors. And you take the lid off, and it's the cutest kabuki. Oh my gosh. This is so soft. It's amazing. This is the softest brush that Sigma sent me. I'm not even kidding you. And this is great for applying powder on the go because you don't want to throw, like, one of these kabuki brushes in your purse because it can get damaged. So this one is just really nice. And I think this makes the cutest Valentine's Day gift for your daughter, your mom, your best friend, you know. And this is $25, which is not bad. It is the softest brush, and I really like that. Another gift that's great for Valentine's Day, which is actually one of my favorites, is the Pink Fire Dazzle Heart Pocket Mirror. And this is also $25, and it comes in the cutest pouch that says Sigma on it. And, oh my gosh, yes, it is a mirror, and it is a heart and it has hot pink rhinestones on it and on the back it just says Sigma with a little plastic thing I'll keep that on there but um it has two mirrors oh my gosh I love this I think this is the cutest Valentine's Day gift because it's pink a heart you know Valentine's Day um, I think this is a great gift for you know anyone that's a girl obviously um, so it's really nice and I think it's just a nice gift for a girl just to have like her own signature mirror so I just want to show you guys those two products just to give you some ideas of Valentine's Day gifts and to show you guys that Sigma sells a ton of different things not just makeup brushes and they're all priced at a really good price okay so now for the contest I am going to be giving away one Sigma brush roll with all 12 brushes in it and um, I'm sure it will come with the little 217 as well so I'm going to be giving away one of these, not this one. This one is mine. Um, I actually don't have the one I'm going to be giving away because whoever wins, I'm just going to send the address to Sigma and they'll just ship it straight to you. So how you can enter to win your own Sigma brush set, you get all of the 12 brushes in here for free with the brush roll. All you have to do, there's two different ways you can enter. You can leave a comment or you can leave a video response or you can leave both. So what I want you guys to do is basically tell me why you think you deserve to win this brush set with the brush roll and everything. And also I just wanted to take this opportunity for you guys to tell me what you like most about my channel and what you would like to see more of. Like for example, maybe you like hair tutorials more and you'd like to see a certain hair tutorial. Just kind of tell me that. Um, so you can leave a comment telling me why you think you deserve the Sigma brush set and you know what you like about my channel and what you'd like to see more of in a comment. You can only leave one comment per person and if you leave more than one comment you will be disqualified. Um, and I'm just going to do like a little random drawing. So if you leave a comment below you get entered once and if you leave a video response basically just telling me the same thing then you get entered two times. And if you enter both ways then you get entered three times total. So you will have three chances to win, which is a lot better than just having one chance to win. So, um, yeah, and the video has to be live. You can't, like, do it in writing. It has to be, you know, you talking to the camera. Um, so if you want two extra chances of winning, then you can leave a video response. So that's basically it. This video might be a little bit long, but I was trying to talk to you guys about a lot of different stuff. 
Um, overall, I really recommend these brushes, and if you are saving up for MAC brushes, I'd say don't go for the MAC brushes. Go for Sigma. They are amazing, and I really, really like them. So be sure to comment and or leave a video response to be able to win your own Sigma brush set. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you very soon. Bye.